Welcome to Decker Tech. I'm Aaron Decker, and today we're going to do a random obelisk challenge where I take a random set of four characters, take them through obelisk mode uh, Madness 10, see how far I can get. My expectations for myself are to be able to beat the Archon and complete it fully uh, just with any sort of random characters, and uh, yeah, I think I can do that. Uh, what we'll do is I will kind of do normal gameplay i'm not going to do necessarily a new player guide i will try to explain everything as it comes up uh definitely the decision points i will explain through my thought process on them i'll try to not take too long with it but i would like you to be able to follow along with what i do as i do it uh this is a part of a series where uh, i recently put a poll out saying hey what would you guys like to see and then depending on the spoons as they allow taking those as i can and completing those in the order that uh I can make them happen and this is one of those videos that i should be able to make happen fairly well with a low spoon cost so let's get straight to it random name generator Doo -doo -doo. i plugged all the names in and we're gonna go with uh, i'm gonna hit random here and i'm gonna do group one no ifs ands or buts andrin nesglect evelyn gustav okay so with that whoop, let me get my screen sorted out here Great new. So we have Andrin, Nesglik, Evelyn, and Gustav. And I will not be doing it in the order that they gave me. I will switch this round. Andrin is obviously going to be my tank or Evelyn, but probably Andrin because Evelyn requires some sort of self chill of them. I think Andrin probably has the best defenses. He goes super fast and he can just use deflex to keep himself alive. Nesglect and Gustav will try to keep us uh, our team healed up and Evelyn will be our main DPS. Uh, with that, the speeds of these heroes, what's their base speeds here? So we got an 18, 19, 13, and 13. So I do have a tie between Nesglect and Evelyn. So it is important the order I put these two in. Uh, if I wanted to, I could probably put Gustav in the back to tank a couple hits and put these other two like this, but I think this is the order I want. Uh, because as I play, I do want ties, like, I want them to go in a specific order. I want my DPS to go last, and Evelyn is going to be probably my strongest source of damage in this setup. Yes. All right, so with this, when I'm picking these cards, I have one reroll. But I basically got to pick these packs and, and live with it. Three of these packs. Uh, I'm basically looking for the, the packs with the least amount of injuries in them. By injuries, I mean just like in the card in the game as you play, when you, uh, you get an injury, it's a, you draw a card and it does crap for you. Uh, in this case, there's going to be a couple cards that I'm never going to play. And I'm just trying to mitigate my losses and the, the damage that these cards are doing to me. Because I have few options to, to change my deck to remove. I, I have very few options to remove cards. Very few options to upgrade cards. So if it's not playable in its current state, I'm not going to be playing it. So Andrin, I'm looking for survival options and or stuff to kind of help the team put some vulnerable on the team. Nesglick will do some vulnerable as well. Um, so what do we got here? That's some vulnerable. Don't really need these other two. Disengage is not a very good card. It's a lot of energy for very small payoff. It does have evasion, so it's okay. Uh, the find weakness is really the card reason I'm picking that one. If I did, I'm not going to be picking up any hunters, no bards no snipers uh explorers so i think it's fencer explorer maybe reaver maybe rogue and definitely the random so let's look at these i think i would want to reroll for a better like this is an okay this this is definitely a gamble to reroll this because there are two upgraded rares here so that's pretty nice but this blade flurry as good as it is i'd rather be doing other things so I think we take the fencer because it's too much of a risk otherwise. And we re-roll everything else because I don't see anything else I'm really excited to play as uh, as frontline Andrin here. Okay, know what we got. Hit and run. This is pretty good. Trace on any hero. That's good. Yeah. Oh, no, hit and run's not good. I thought this was the one with dodge. Fast is not... We don't need fast. We need dodge. Ode to War requires stanza. We don't have that. Require stands. I guess I could go a little Barty here. Um, tune up. And that's my only source of stanza one. Oh, and Captivating Voice. Ooh, I could maybe do it. This is Ode to War. This is any hero. So I can either dodge myself or Powerful Evelyn. So 
and I've got the Dispels and the Caldrops. Maybe we pivot to that. See, this one has a setup, but it's not upgraded, and I'm, I'm never going to be able to upgrade it, so it's not a very good card. And the rest of these are just not very powerful effects. So, looks like we're going Bard Andron. Doo -doo -doo. Um, I like Parry just because it's got Triple Fortify. That's pretty good. And this requires stanza and requires lots of energy. I'm not going to be able to get that off uh, very often. So that's definitely it. We'll come back to, I guess we can do his perks right now. So I want block charges because I'm looking to do deflex. And I do have, let's see, we look down here. I have three cards with block on them. Yeah, so I think, I think two charges would be okay here. I want vulnerable because I'm one of the few people that will be applying it. And even though I don't have many of them in my deck, I've only got the one. Uh, I want at least two people to have the option to apply vulnerable to the enemy team. Andrin has a self fast thing, so I'll do fast for himself and speed for himself. Yes, I think that's good. What else am I missing here? Looking down here, I got a lot of regen. What are my regen cards? Sweet melodies. Problem is regen doesn't really scale well with perks. And I can't really roll this Ode War. Oh, I want evasion charges. Nope, we're not allowed evasion charges. I don't see anything else here that'll help us out. Vitality, if I had it, I don't really have much vitality. Um, and I'm not really trying to do any damage. And I don't have any slow effects. So this is what we got. Maybe all resistances or hit points. But I think all of these are going to be serve me better for that. It's, it's usually better to upgrade your cards than to upgrade your hit points. Gustav. Um... What are we looking for him? We're looking for keeping the team alive. Maybe switch him into a little bit of damage dealing because Andrin didn't get uh, much defensive stuff here. Like, because Andrin picked up a couple sweet melodies. So Andrin might be helping to keep the team alive. So, what do we got here? We're not going to be going Poisoner. Because if he is our main damage dealer, he's more of like our, our speed manipulation. We don't need chance of accuracy. Our main damage is going to be a caster here. We're looking for upgraded or cheap cards. We definitely don't want these eight cost. Like, I'm never going to play this card. That means I have to play it on turn three. I have to save up my first turn and one of my other turns. So either two turns worth of energy. Uh, I have to have stanza three going, which Gustav can do. So, and I have to draw this on turn three. The chances of drawing this card on turn three without any sort of deck manipulation is less than one in three. So, no thank you. So, we're really looking for a better song pack. A better song pack. I mean, we're just going to have to roll the dice all the way. There's, there's nothing here that stands out to me as playable. Okay, Song of Celerity, that's okay. It's only plus one, but that's good. Chant of Accuracy again, we don't want. Ode to War, this is the target hero. Ooh, that's good, that's good. We can turn one, give that to Evelyn. I wouldn't mind getting some damage ourselves though, but I don't see any good Song cards. We got a Blade Flurry and a Poison Daggers. We got some good repeats here. If he gets a good weapon, that will, that'll go well. I don't think the Song of Celerity is going to help us out too much, but I like it better than some of my other options. But this is an injury, and this is an injury. These two just aren't going to help me at all in the entire game. Like, throughout the game, I'm going to be cutting them eventually. Trace, this is only myself. No, Innate, any hero. Okay, that's good. That's actually good. Bad Vigilance, that's an injury. Double Strike, that's an injury. Yeah, double bard. I mean, these uh, this Andrin Gustav is not the uh, not a good game gonna make. We're not gonna be poisoning. Rain of arrows cost two turns and does. I'm not gonna be scaling into it. So I think it's poisoner and bard. Got lots of injuries on our deck. Ooh, ballad of evasion. The turn three version, not the turn two version. Problem is, even though this is upgraded, normally in adventure mode. I'd be able to switch it over to the blue very easily. Not the case in an in, in a obelisk challenge. I gotta I gotta bear with it the whole time. I think I'd rather music sheet. One into our hand, cost cheap, it's purple, it starts in our hand, it's one cost. Yeah. 
think that'd be good. I'll just try to always get something I can play on turn one or something that I can... I need to find like a trace or something for him to put it down to turn two. All right, so of the healing songs, powerful, vitality, regen. Yes, oh, and speed, fast. Because uh, did I pick up the song of celerity? I have song of celerity. Because I want to make this Ode to War powerful. I want to, whatever comes in the music sheet, I want that to be powerful. And that's usually the, the thing I'm looking for is the vitality to all heroes. And yeah, I think that's where we're at. So I've got Song of Quickness and Song of Celerity to speed us up. This Chant of Accuracy is a dead card in this team. I mean, I'll probably be throwing it to Andrin, who's got this Blade Flurry, or myself, who's got the Blade Flurry. Yeah. Maybe I should lean to the Blade Flurry a little more. Nesglect. We want healing. Healing is madness and sight. Mind twist is okay. None of these are upgraded. That's a good reason to re-roll them. I'm looking for less injuries. Anthem of Hope is a really good card for Nesglect. Uh, it's kind of late game plan. I'd rather just straight up heal. So because this has a zero cost clarity and the, the upgraded Anthem of Hope, I'll probably pick this up. Because that's only one injury. And that's that's plenty good to, to rely on. And none of the rest of this is really upgraded. And my random pack doesn't have anything exciting. So reroll. Well, that got worse. That got way worse. This is a playable pick one healing spell from your vanish pile. I don't know if I have any vanishing heals. These got fairly playable. Hey, look, delay response, my favorite card. So what do we got here? A dilute. So the mentalist got worst. The seer has one playable card, the expected prophecy. With it, it does allow me to kind of filter my deck a little bit. I'm thinking Devotee just because of the Panacea. Shield of Warding is eh at best, but definitely playable. I have lots of Dispels, and I've got two Sweet Melodies and two on both my Bards. So I don't need the Dispel, so this is a no. So honestly, it's just going to be these two bad boys right here. Pandemonium. Yes, please. Six energy is the hard part, though. I'd rather have the four cost. Can we afford a six cost pandemonium? Can we afford to skip it? Spark of Life is nice, but very slow, and, and Nesglick does not scale well into healing spells. So we're going to go for pandemonium. We're going to make sure we get vulnerable charges. Hey, look, you can't get vulnerable charges on Nesglick. That is annoying. That is annoying. I want to play into this pandemonium, so I want... I need Insane Insight for increased healing. And I want... Look down here. I got buffer charges. Nope. Can't do buffer charges. Courage charges. Don't really need courage charges. Vulnerable charges. Hey, look, I can't do that. So I think we just speed him up a little. And give him a little bit of damage. The damage is kind of meh. Compared to your other options, it's usually better to get one of the curses. Yeah. I'm probably going to regret not picking something up here, but I don't see what it is. Yep, yep, yep. That's fine. Evelyn. All right, so some sort of DPS Evelyn is can be any flavor. There's an upgraded scroll of intellect, but it's the wrong kind for her to be the DPS. Looking for upgraded, efficient cards. Ray of Frost is nice to nuke one person, but it's still only a 10 to 1 ratio. 40 damage for 4 energy, so not that good. Fireball's better. I don't see many upgraded ones. This random doesn't have anything good in it. Elemental Bolt, maybe, but it's got a charge battery, which is an injury. An electricity manual, unupgraded, which is an injury. I wouldn't mind the Ray of Frost, but the problem is the Shatter is hard to pull off without a lot of other chill. And 
with no one else setting up the chill before her. She has to do it all herself. So I think this is just 100% a reroll and try our luck again. Bow. Okay. So probably this one, the Icicle Barrage isn't so bad. I like that. Unupgraded, that's still pretty good. Then we got another Icicle Barrage over here. These are blue ones, which are self-chill. Hmm. We can turn bleed into block for the next turn. That's fine. So I think it's barrage, barrage, and elemental bolt upgraded. Yeah, that's pretty good. Bam, bam, bam. I'm looking for a blizzard. Winter orb. That'll do. Thanks. So chill, frost. What else do we need for her? Probably speed her up since we sped Nezglicked up and they were tied. And I got one more here. What does she want? Uh, she's powerful. Definitely powerful. Because that way she can pick up a powerful item. Excellent. Do do do. Hey, like a shadow orb and no shadow guys. Uh, who needs to go faster? Gustav? Gustav needs to go faster. Andrin will pick up some extra damage. Damage with hit. Apply sight. I mean, for now, that's going to go on Evelyn, I guess. Remember, we can upgrade these to corrupted with uh, if I pick the same item twice. So I don't want to neglect that option. All right, so my pathing is going to be really simple. I'm going to find the most nodes and the most elite nodes. Because elite nodes give loot, and I like loot. One, two, three, four. So I go, we connect the dots. I have four elites going that way. Uh, basically, you should always take the first corruptor because if you can't beat the first corruptor, you're really close to just re-rolling the whole run. Like if I can't, if I lose to this, that's fine. I just start a new run. Like that's, that's pretty legit. I'm going super fast. These two are going still kind of slow. How did, did I not speed Nez clicked up? Oh no! Oh no, I need to find an item! Where's my perks? I did not get plus one speed. Thought I did. That's unfortunate, that means everyone's going before him. It's fine, it's fine. We're fine here. How are you? So you do start with six energy. Wow, that's, that's insane. Need to kill Bob. I have a card draw. Might as well card draw. Can expert tracker someone whose turn is important? Who stops? Or Evelyn's? Evelyn has a magic mushroom, so let's give it to Evelyn. Remove, 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 remove. I don't think she has enough energy to do all this, so we'll get rid of that. Yep. Bam. And then I can play all my cards. Ding. Hi, Gustav. I need you to speed up the team. Go towards Evelyn. Should have done this first. Stanza one. Turn a lullaby. Yes, please. Oh, corrupted song. So nice. We're all going fast. They're all going slow. We win. Awesome. So I have Winter's Orb. I have Frost Nova. I have Life Tap. Six, seven. So it's whether I want a Frost Nova or a Ray of Frost. How about we do... Ray of Frost doesn't quite kill Bob, but Frost Nova would kill it with a Ray of Frost. Or I could try my luck with a Winter Orb. That seems like a lot more damage than Ray of Frost, right? 10 to 1. Yeah. So how about we Nova and Winter Orb and just go with luck? Excellent. Um, should we life tap? Yes, we should life tap. Should we ignite? No. Do, 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 do. Who's going next? Basically my whole team, right? So who's got heals? Gustav's got heals. Don't need any of these. Don't need this. Don't need this. Oh, I, of course I can't. Uh, yeah, there we go. Bam. 
got a heal. I got six energy. I can cast everything. This plus a little bit of damage up front and some mind vision up front. I didn't need to fade. That was dumb. That was a waste of energy because I would rather him take a hit than him take two hits. So the random shots thing going on. Wild Mushroom to Gustav if I have a Scry or a Trace Effect. I have a... Put something on my top of my deck and deflect with it. So if I can find a Song card... Maybe I should have checked to see if there was a Song in my deck. Did I read that wrong? Oh, this is the very bad tune-up. That was super dumb. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah! Powerful entity. But I go before them all. They should all be dead. Doesn't really matter. Um, I could either speed us up, dispel, or do a little bit of damage. Teeny bit of damage. Or heal us up for next turn. I'd rather heal us up a little. And it would be nice to have Nezglick in front of Evelyn so that Evelyn doesn't kill everyone. Uh, for this and this. So it's Ice Spickle Barrage first, then Cold Spark, because it does more damage that way. You need to kill Mr. Man in the front. These are randoms, so let's do some randoms. Unless this can kill something, 18, 19, can't kill anything yet. Although he's burning and he's bleeding. 18 plus 3, 21, not enough. So I need to kill... Ugh, dang it. So close. Let's go ahead and finish him off. Oh, he's dying. What I what I miss? Oh, it applies burn. Duh. Let's see. Three. Mental shake or a curative. I'd rather just mental shake because mental shake heals. Or I could just kill something. Killing is good in this case. Not in usual cases. And then Andrew, you're going next. What do you want? You don't need Ode. You don't need Caltrops. You have a very painful deck, sir. Bye, Bacon. Should have done Sweet Melody. And I should have done that first. There's a lot of things I should have done. Four. Whistle just kills, so Melody and Whistle. Or I could let Nez have a turn. Nez is going after the pig, so I can't let him have a turn. I need to find things that generate here, and since I don't have ways to thin my deck, I really just need to put as little into my decks as possible. I wouldn't mind the clarity per se, because if you go to 16, that means you can cut. Except for Nezglect is going after... Eve, and that really, really hurts. There. Fixed it. It was never a problem. Uh, play a spell, draw a card. I can go on basically anyone here. I think I want that on either Gustav or Evelyn, but Evelyn has trouble. She, she can't spend all of her energy, right? I don't know what the Corrupted one does. I think it's more damage. But the fact that it has plus damage means Evelyn should have it. Oh, here's Powerful. We're good. I figured it out. Ta-da! If you can find a way to make it so two items go on people usefully, then that's probably better than doing only one item. That says I have a super fight later. Sub zero. Hmm. Can't be slowed. Lots of damage. And they paralyze me. If you ain't living, I mean, if you ain't, if you ain't risking, you ain't living. All right, so I got to kill things, at least one thing this round. Or go before them all next round. They got a lot of fast heroes. I didn't really look at that. All right, so marking the back and going stealthy. Hitting someone random, going stealthy, back. Okay, so back's taking a lot of heat, and they're all stealthing. So I should probably try to kill... Can't kill anything. I've applied slow, but I can't slow them. Excellent. You have chosen. Just 
Scarred up to seven. I think Ray of Frost is fine. I think this is all fine. So this is going to stealth right away. This is going to stealth right away. So I need to try to kill Crunky, I guess. Sure. <laughs> He's not technically going stealth, but now if I hit him, he goes stealth, right? So he is stealth. Uh, see what my options are. Which tune up is this? Put, find one from deck and put it on top of your deck. So basically pick the only one I can play, speed the group up a little bit. Oh, I could have tuned up and then drawn because I have the magic tome. Cool. Smart I am. <laughs> Just all the damage to the front man. Because we need to kill something so that we don't die next round. Uh, what do I want next turn? Next turn I want Ode to War. I would like to draw more cards. I don't need to heal anyone, per se. Let's just nuke some stuff. So I think Evelyn can kill Trunky, so I want to actually put this on the guy that's not going to die this round. So that I might have healing for next round. Because Icicle Barrage plus Cold Snap is going to be a lot of damage. Or a uh, Cold Spark. Um... Do I need Ray of Frost? I don't need Ray of Frost, right? This is nine. Plus some icicles. We should be fine. Random! Oh, these are targeted. Look at that. Targeted icicles. Not even random icicles. Uh, do I life tap? No. Do I sickle? No. Because that's targeted. Could have kept my random one for last. I don't know if I had a random one. Uh, place a song spell from your hand on top of your deck. Let's not do that in the wrong order. See, this is a problem trying to go bard without being good Gustav. Um, yes. What do I want next turn? I want Sweet Melody. Oh, I played Tune Up. Haha. -ha. I can play this game, y'all. Hi, Gustav. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. We just lost Evelyn. Hmm. 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 So Harpy did a lot of damage. All right. Let's see if I can play this a little more efficiently. Um. So I still find with Tracker Ring. They're both stealthing before I can do anything, unless I have a card draw here, which I don't. So. Uh, Gustav can speed people up. Sure. 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 Maybe I need to heal. I probably need to heal, right? Yes. Yes, yes, that looks fine. Um, if I give her two mark, is she stealthing too much? Stealth three? Yeah, so this mark's not enough. I can't prevent her from stealthing. And if I put it on this guy, he's going to just clear it his own. So I think we're still doing the same damage plan. For this time, I'll do a little more damage, a little less parry. A little more rock and roll. Yeah, because she comes out with doing a multi-attack from that stealth, that really hurt. <laughs> she also had Mark on her. That was part of her downfall. So clearing that out helps an awful lot. Doo -doo -doo. Anthem. Didn't really matter who I did this on, right? Oh, I did not filter her deck, so this does matter a little bit. Whoops. So six, maybe seven. So I have a Ray of Frost and a Frost Nova. 
So, fitted to the front guy. So, the front guy's dead. So, second guy. And front guy. Blam! No one has poison. They're immune to frost. It don't matter. I mean, I lose 11 hit points, but 6 barrier. They're not doing elemental damage to me, so, I mean... And as you can see, some of these cards are just injuries. This is just an injury. I'm never going to play it. Every time I draw it, I'm not going to play it. Icy Veins is almost an injury. Like, 98% an injury. Alright, from a hand on top of your deck, have a card draw. Have a card draw. Go to war for sure. Sweet Melody. And I can't stop any of them. Just give myself some stanza. Okay, the, the universe is different. They have changed their stuff because I have changed the universe, as is the case with things. So, see, I got lots of dispels. This is great. I can't get to the paralyzed, though. If I speed up the team, plus four, 19, yeah, goes, this makes us go faster than that. Excellent. And then I can kill off the front one. See, this poison daggers is doing like six damage. Whispering lies doing way more. And so that was why I say I was looking at these decks and I was like, even though it's upgraded, if I'm not scaling into it, it's just not, it's not enough. Real three songs from your draw pile and place one on top of your deck. I'm going to be drawing most of them anyway. I'm okay with not doing that. Tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Can't play this pandemonium. Because I did not be spending energies. So this is going to be random heroes and it's going to do lots of damage. I don't have anything in my Vanish Pile. It's not a good card, y'all. But I need health. I guess I could have done it on Andrin. Maybe it was better on Andrin. And then, what do I want for next turn? I can play these. This turn, I think that's better than... Uh... Yeah, otherwise. Bloop. Bloop. A little bit of healing. Sometimes a zero cost card is just better just for the fact that it's zero cost. Oof, Winter's Orb. I need to remember to save one energy at ground just to make sure I get this Winter's Orb off. That's unfortunate. I think Icicles are the way to go. Except for I'm suffering chill to myself. Stealth Sniper. I was going to say, why someone has to explain to me how he got healed, but he got healed because of his... Alright, so... They're both going before me, unless I have a way to change that. I do not. Four energy. I do have a card draw with a spell. So let's give evasion to someone. Who is the lowest HP hero? 46. Evasion. And now I can Dispel Paralyze. And I can hit some things. Should have Power Slayed first to give myself some Powerful. Yep, I know how to play this game. And Sharp uh, to Andrin in case he takes a turn. Okay, so I did not look at turn order. The evasion needed to go there. Check. All right, Nesglick, what can you do here? I'm going to need you to heal people. I have no Vanish cards, right? Where's my Vanish deck? I have no heal cards in my Vanish. See, see there's just injuries. Some cards are just injuries. I don't know if there's a way for me to save Andrin, except for on his turn, he Sweet Melody himself? Okay, okay. So I need to kill the Harpy, the Sky Hunter. I don't think I can. Rip! 
Alright, so there's no avoiding the death. We're gonna heal up a little. If I heal... If I can kill the bad guy, I can save myself a turn. 15. Plus 9, 4. Boo. At least he heals still. Tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Taking one burn damage, right? Icicle. Don't kill him. Okay, we're good. We're good. No one died. No characters were harmed in the making of this video. I need to give a turn to Nezglect, so I can't kill the main man. And I don't really have anything to do here other than just give powerful... Ow. Ow. Maybe I should have looked at my decks. Cool. Cool. That was cool. Make sure you have no injuries on your deck. No injuries. Check. Yeah. I need to remember to save one energy for that frozen orb. Uh, upgraded setup. Cost one, gain one back. That's actually pretty good for the guy having song problems, so we'll do that. Uh, nothing useful here. Benediction, yes please. And... Even if you Dark Ritual yourself, it's a lot of energy, but the problem is it's slow energy, you're hurting yourself. I do not have the best healing right now, so we shall not do that. When you play a skill, gain evasion. <laughs> skill, 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 skill. I feel like that's one. Skill. Yeah. You be a ninja. But then who gets the breastplate then? Good question. Who gets the Jade Ring then? So what if I put the skill on... Because I don't need the Rangers. I, that's 6%. What kind of skills she got back here? No skills. What kind of skills she's got here? Oh, he's going to play me playing Music Sheet every time. Every single time. But he's also playing the deflect every time it comes up. So these two, one of these two needs to do the ninja scroll. And then that leaves the breastplate for the other one. Well, Andrew's the one that died. So I feel like the extra resistances to him makes the most sense. But I mean, ninja scroll. Because he's got plus two, she's got plus one. It should be fine. It should be fine. They're all fast now. So it's who needs more resistances. I feel like Nezglect. Oh, well, Nezglect has the potion. That would have been a reason for me to not do him. Do, 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 do. Mayonnaise. Sure. I don't actually know what that does. I'm pretty sure that's the right answer. Um, so this one says draw through your deck really well. And gain lots of defenses. I kind of prefer Wild Hunt just to put more damage on the enemy, though. Because they both... Yeah. Because I don't have an efficient enough deck that Maneuver really makes much sense. Let's heal some people. Night Terror, of course. And... Enchant Weapons? I feel like Enchant Weapons is the answer. Go more elites. Gustav will gain expose armor. No. They're all fast. We're all slow. I could probably get ahead of them on turn two. And we might not get Blitzkrieg on turn one. Evelyn might die turn one. This is a backline hitter. This is a healer. This is a frontline hitter and a middle hitter. There's a frontline and middle hitter. So I might lose either Gustav or Evelyn. Gustav has new armor. Yeah, we got this. Let's 
Tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Ooh, it was close. It was close. Ninja scroll. I gain it and then I can ode. Yeah, that's good. That's good. So, who needs to slow down? I need. I think Gustav can speed me up. So I don't have to worry about Trunky, I don't think. But I think I need to slow down the Sky Hunter. Are they immune to slow? No, they're not immune to slow. So let's slow down the Sky Hunter. Let's give Powerful to Evelyn. And I can either hit something or I can block for myself. I really don't need much block for myself anymore now that I got double evasion charges. Gustav might still die. Gustav might die. Think. Gustav, please don't die. Ooh, Ballad of Conquest. Yes, please. Never ending story. Yes, please. Whispering Lies. Probably better just because I can play it right now. Mm. Ballad of Conquest, though. That's pretty good. Can I go through my deck fast enough? I mean, I can't play it now. But if I go through my deck fast enough, I think I need to give myself one evasion charge. Bloop. And... None of the rest of this does anything. Tell me lies. It's stuck in my head. It's going to be stuck in my head forever. A little bit of healing in my life. Who's going to live the longest? It's probably this guy right here. Cold Spark. Icicle Barrage. These guys are weak to fire, except for this guy. So I think I switched to fire. Yeah, so enchant weapon, fire. Whoops, fire. Then I go Icicle Barrage. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I got to play one more before I do the other Icicle Barrage. So... Blast. Barrage. Funky. I've got to kill him because he goes next. There we go, Evelyn. Alright, now I need to catch up on healing. What are they doing? Fast and healing. Uh, I'm going before everyone. Almost. Okay, so they're just playing defensive, so I can play defensive too. So, four energy, just double heals? Sure. <laughs> Save energy. Evelyn did not save energy for her Frost Orb. He is high resistance to fire. Or I could just try to blitz her down this turn. Let me just try to blitz her down this turn. Mm, we could pry life tap. Two cards, though. Two cards. Charge battery. No one wants a charge battery. Tell me lies. Tell me sweet little lies. Yeah. I mean, I know it was a risk, but it really wasn't that much of a risk, considering there was a high chance for at least three hits, right? Um, Place one song from your hand on top of your deck. Firebrand, you suck. Expert Tracker, I want to dig through Gustav's deck for the heal spell, right? Uh, I have two energy, so aim shot or disengage. Oh, yeah, this is fine. This is fine. Gustav, I would like you to find a slow and or your super button for all of us. 
I should have done that just to get stamp. Super button. Power slave. Ode to war. Double heals. One, two, three, four, five. Ode is a regen and a plus extra damage. It doesn't really matter too much here, this thing. So what do we got here? We got Firebrand and Front Hero. He's going to hit the Front Hero a lot. Front Hero's already got evasion, so we're fine. So we are just... I shouldn't have done that one. I should have done double mouth face. We're fine. And we are all healed up. It was never a problem. There is an injury in Andrin's deck. Because he died. He died. Luckily, uh, the Death Door did not stay in your deck. They do indeed vanish because this is easy mode. Tell me lies. It's stuck in my head. I can't get it out. Injuries in my hand. Oof. Remember that damage I was hoping to do? I gotta, I gotta find more energy for her. That doesn't do anything. I'm in the booger zone. I can do this in a heal, or I can just blade flurry him. Got him. Non-upgraded setup. Music sheet for someone that doesn't have stanza. Addiction. And nothing. Alright, so I got another piece of armor. This one's actually really good for the back line. Uh, I think we're going to be out of Harpy Land soon, though. So this is good. Wouldn't mind the heart amulet, but everyone's got pretty good golden heart. Who's the cost the highest cost song in your hand, but one? Well, no one's going to be holding this belt, because I think I'd prefer five powerful on turn one. And then I'd prefer to reinforce. So that's unfortunate. Shopping. 44% chance. I'm not one for taking gambles. Cloak of Speed. Did you know that the purple Cloak of Speed is worse than the normal Cloak of Speed? Look it up. It's uh, pretty funny. Alright, what does uh, Andrin, his starting thing is once per turn, every, his, uh, character and trait, start of your turn, gain fast, yeah, so, he's already got this, basically. This is really good for Gustav. Although, Sapphire Ring for Evelyn, that might be the, that might be the ticket item right there. I think that's a big ticket. I'm, I'm running into energy issues, so... Um, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. It's whether I need uh, a church or a thing. What are we at? 17 and an injury. Yeah, we're definitely going to church. Uh, Gustav does not want detection. This is a free one. Cool. By free, I mean it doesn't affect me much. Uh, ninja. Place a song from your hand on top of your deck. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I'm going to read that every time. So I think it's three, four, five, six. And slow something down. How about we slow down this guy right here? Plant. Uh, I can dispel off of someone who's going to get hit the most, the front target. I don't want them healing off of me would be the reason to do that. And I do need a little bit of healing myself. Sure. And I don't need this. So we're done with that. Ninja scroll. It's all about the items. Music sheet. None of this was good for me. Um, slowing someone is probably what I want to do. I don't need to heal anyone this turn. So I'll do this second. Uh, Gustav slime chickadoo. So I think it's slow down chickadoo. Let's see. So if I speed everyone up. Then we're fine. Doesn't really matter. It's a slime slowed down. Will be the best, most effective use. So 
Just hold this line. Hit something. What do I want to kill? The back line? This is random? Random. Check. This doesn't do much damage. Probably worth one energy. There. Next turn, I will have the songs ready. Would you like some bless? And some cards. And maybe I should have, you know, done this first. Mm, let's banish her deck. Don't want. Don't want. Don't want. So I have eight. I can transfer to fire. We're switching to fire. So enchant weapon, fire weapons. I can Winter Orb, Nova, and Icicle Barrage. I want to kill her first. Let's do this. 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 Choop, 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 choop. See, and it's really about, in the beginning, when you drafted, finding a combination of efficient cards to play and as few injuries as possible. But you have a consistent deck that has enough kick to get stuff done. Because on these guys' decks, when they have damage cards, they're super efficient. They're hyper efficient cards. Mm, we're not all going first. I need to slow down her. So Gustav needs to find a slow card. Does Gustav have a slow card? He has a speed up card. Yes, I need to find the speed up card. So, how many cards does he have? He has 10. So, 3, 5, 2. I know how to do this. I need to just. Oops. Click on the wrong button here. I need to do all but, uh, all but two of these. What are the two I want to keep? O to war and uh, heal? I don't need an O to heal. Don't need, don't need, don't need. Bam. Uh, find weakness who has the highest fires resist. Oh, that's this guy right here. Found it. Cow drops. Would I like to slice or would I like to parry? I would like to slice. Right, what did I say I need to do? Speed people up. Speed people up. Give some powerful. Got either a little bit of damage or some dispels. I think it's just a little bit of damage. I'm still going in front of her. Give some cards. Give some scry. Life tap. I need life tap to do four. So I could do a frost bolt and an elemental bolt. Yeah. Choo. Whoops. Yeah, that's fine. Mm, Nova and icicle barrage. Do enjoy the Nova. We have been burned. Alright, I would like to give Gustav a turn. We all go before him, so it doesn't really matter much what I do. Gustav needs to cast one thing to heal us all. Uh, I don't. I think that triggers after the spell, though. So I need to do. There we go. It's not an annoying sound at all. Uh, zero cost deflect the draws. You got to be careful with cards like deflect when you pick it up in obelisk mode, because if you accidentally get the yellow one, you're in for a bad time. Um, the gaining, the applying slow and gaining stanza is what I think. He wants more benedictions 
and nothing. Elite combat. Uh, Andrin will gain exposed armor. That's actually a really good card. Any monster for vulnerable. They have hit points, extra damage, immune to frost. Rabbit go fast. Rabbit speed up whole team. But we were at full health, so I don't see them killing us on turn one, blitzing us down turn one. And then I know I can get ahead of them on turn two most of the time, so I should be safe. And if I get the attack everyone AoE from uh, like this, where is it at? His, his, his power slave. Yeah, power slave will clear all the evasion. Uh, I don't have anything to draw cards with. Find weakness, I think. Oh, he's taunting. Yep, that made that decision easy. Music sheet! Eternal Alibi. Yeah, three cost. Three, four, five. Yeah, this is good. So, I do need to heal up. Poison Dagger is not worth the energy. Oh, I needed the Pandemonium. I really needed the Pandemonium. That was a mistake. Crap. Alright. If I end this at less than full hit points, I am restarting the round to play the Pandemonium correctly. Eight. Barrage, Nova, Barrage, Barrage. That was fun. Mm, bleed to shield and apply slow. No. Still need to slow the bunny down a little. Five. Draw, draw three we got here how deep do i need to go i wouldn't mind the expertise expert tracker whatever so let's go two one there's the slow the bunny down so i can still set up so i can slow the bunny down and put back dispel magic is what i think i want and both these captivating voices are the same oh this is taunting whoops i can't slow down the bunny I don't think I need the captive any voice next turn, so this is fine. That doesn't increase the speed any. I can't dispel her twice. I need to... That 10 chill is hurting. Can I get through his damage? Whistle! One shy. If I had... Chant of accuracy myself before that last hit. It would have worked. Did I have Power Slave? I had Power Slave, didn't I? I had Power Slave, I didn't click. I'm smart. SMRT. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no ward, no charge battery, and no transmission. Excellent. Neither of those, though, either, because she can't afford to cast him. She can if she life taps. That was dumb of me. It's fine. It's fine. All right, so fire again. It's always fire with these people. Whoops, I did that in the wrong order. But that's because I'm smart. Saving one energy. I probably should have saved both. That last icicle probably wasn't worth it. Bunny rabbit. So he can't cast Pandemonium. 
And he's not going to draw it. That's fine. There's a fish explosion here. I'm looking to who to expert tracker. Dispel and heal. Dispel and back chick. And buffing her. Yep. The problem with the blade flurry is it only hits front monster. And I don't need to hit this bunny right now. Oh, come with me now. So if I give plus six to my team, plus two to him, that doesn't get him in front. Plus six is 23. That puts me in front of the walrus in this one. So I'm just behind the bunnies. I think that's good. There, got the decay off of her. The decay on everyone is really not fun. Alright, so we want to try to kill both the rabbits at the same time. I don't know if I'm gonna do it correctly. Not not playing that pandemonium correctly is really an issue, I think. I don't need to fade, but let's set this pandemonium up for next turn. Four, five. I only have five. I didn't save enough. Energy is more important than cards in Obelisk mode, and I buggered that far. Life tap. I don't need weapons until after. So, I mean, I think it's still Winter Orb, because I've got Evasion on. I don't have a way to get an energy in Nez. Let's just restart. Uh, that, that pandemonium was a big, big misplay. Major, major misplay. I really don't like the fact that I can't get uh, vulnerable charges on. What's his face? Ninja scroll. I have eight, so it's Raj, Raj, Nova. They're all applied to, right? So I don't know that. Saving energy. We all have one less card. The universe is different because I didn't do the, uh, what's it called? So I can Captivating Voice and Sweet Melody. Get the Dispels off on her. Keep her a little thin on the, dis on the things that are whatnot. Okay, so let's see, so. We draw, we have a power slave, we have a dispel that speeds her up two that puts her in front of walrus. Yes, excellent. I need to remember to not kill him because Bunny's just going to summon a bunny. Yep. Whoops. Vanish cards. I don't want to see. I don't want to see this one. I don't want to see this one. And transmission's not here. I don't want to see this icicle. I don't think. Maybe let's just get rid of the frostbolt. Icicles at least 
Icicle's random monster. I don't want random monsters. Next turn, I have five. So, Winter's Orb, Enchant, and hopefully draw the Life Tap. Walrus is probably going to be the last one standing. should uh, maybe consider not doing vigorous on a bunny rabbit because the bonus hit points on bunny rabbits is problematic all right so we got me a couple of them and then all of me so who needs more cards and why he needs to draw his night terror he's drawing all that draw your night terror please I don't need therapy, I don't need Ray of Hope, I don't need a Pufferfish, I don't need an upgraded Mental Shake, I don't need a normal one either, but we'll leave it there. Then I can slow something down. What are you doing? Yeah, that's pretty annoying. Bloop. Plays a song from your hand, I don't have a song in my hand. Monty. I guess I could use that to clear the evasion is what I could have used that for. Instead of just slowing down him, I could have used evasion on Monty. So put us in front of that guy. Dispel some stuff. I need to buff Evelyn. We need some more power! And I need to break the evasions. Alright, what do we got, Evelyn? Can you kill? Can you kill? Can you kill my... Alright, then what do I want for next turn? Benediction and a mental shake for next turn. Sure. Maybe the clarities are supposed to go to someone else, but I like having options on Evelyn. Four, only three, only three. So that's a Frost Nova, that's all I got, or an Elemental Bolt. Yay. Because expensive cards are expensive. Rabbits are about to die. Rabbit town population, not them. So this just kills the bunny that's already dying. I don't need that. Slow someone down. Walrus or that guy. Can't have him healing the bunny rabbits. And then I need to pop some evasion. Draw cards. Draw cards. Oops, I shouldn't do that myself because I'm about to do one of these. Um, let's just. I don't need to pop the front monster. So let's pop some evasion. Can you save? Awkward. 44, that kills him. He's got lots of bleed. Rabbits are dead. Oh shoot, no they're not. Dang it, dang it, dang it. 
lowest HP monster. That's going to be this rabbit up front. He's going to get 20 hit points. It's the best I can do. Best I can do. So I can gain, but I can't use. Uh, who do I need to slow down? Bloop. Rabbits be annoying. Is this guy healing again? He is not. Draw cards. Uh, draw cards. Hit someone for random. Let's pop an evasion first. Of course. I want to draw next turn. I'm going to draw it anyway. If I get a scry, I need to put on Gustav. He's got two injuries in his deck now. Three injuries in his deck. I don't see any scries here. 14 or 20, that's okay. Or we can just hit things. I feel like we just need to hit things. Boop. See, it's mostly an injury. But except for when it's not. Uh, I'm going in a very nasty, like, I'm in the bad zone here. Slow this guy down. Mark this guy up. I should have sliced instead of marking, but we're okay. Does anybody have any missiles left? You guys know that movie quote? Fine. Totally fine. Super fine. She has nothing. Easy peasy. I'm actually fine with this because uh, as long as I don't take a speed manipulation one, he should live. I don't know, that doesn't even kill this guy because he's got so much block. I can't even kill the bat guy. Not doing enough damage. 30, 40, 50. Mm -hmm. I should have liked that. Boo! Now I've got two injuries. But I'm going to the church next turn. It's fine. It's fine. Nope. Could have done that on myself. Could have done that on myself. Could have done the weakness too. Ow. Don't want to kill him. Just want to get a little bit of healing. A little bit of healing in my life. No, that wasn't round seven. All that for an exposed armor. I was just doing it for the challenge, if anything. Uh, I wouldn't mind a song of quickness, except for he does not guarantee Danza one in the first turn. And that does vanish at least. How many stanzas do I have? Got one. 
two, three stanzas. He already has 18, 19 cards. I'm removing one here and two at the next one. So adding cards at this point is just bad for him. 17, 18, that's the right number. 20, that's high. 16, so Evelyn should be picking something up. Sure, Shatter looks good. Every turn, small weapon into your deck. That's that's rough. I don't like any of these. Does he even have any defense cards? He's got a deflect. I thought Gustav had the super armor. So Golden Chalice might be better than Divination Orb. Considering I have three benedictions. It can't be better then. Because later once I get to the skills, uh it's it's the the divination orb is just fantastic. This guy does sometimes get the Nope, that's only with the spell scroll. Oh, Poison Dagger, Corrupted. Ah! It's a new feature. I could have corrupted his Poison Dagger. Yep. It's not late at night or anything. Alright, so, going to the chapel, I can actually move more than one. I was thinking it was just one. So, now I'm looking for all the injuries, the things that I've never played whenever I draw them. So... There's this chant of accuracy I don't really like. It is at least a song. I think the tune-up goes away. Try the poison daggers and the viper strikes of the world. The tune-up this one generates stanza, so that one's like, it's not the worst. It is really bad, though. I'd rather just play the Captivating Voices. The Disengage we don't need, especially since we got Ninja Scroll. Slice. I'm not, I am going to be going melee attacks eventually. So I have one slice, but it's not upgraded is the problem. This Hunter's Mark is a skill, so that's probably better than the slice. But I do get momentum. What's the, uh, I can't, I can't look at their... Can't look at their talents from here. He's got momentum or range or whatever, so this goes up just because it replaces itself um, energy cost-wise. So probably the tune-up goes away. Because I'd rather just captivating voice. The aim shot definitely goes away. Parry at least burns is a nice thing. I like captivating voice sweet melody is a lot of what it does. The blade flurries and slices of the world He's going to go a little hybrid here. So the Hunter's Mark just don't have enough things to play off of it. And this tune-up go bye-bye. Okay. Uh, I'm going to run out of gold. Elemental Ward and Charger Battery. Never played those. Never will. Uh, Foresight's pretty rough. Fade is super rough. Moment Apparel is super rough. Curative Therapy is super rough. Ray of Hope, I probably don't want, but I'm out of gold. Excellent. I screwed that up monstrously because, you see, I can get a free one right here. So I removed one too many from Andrew and Nevelyn, and one not enough from Mezglite. So this is Momentum. This is probably Fanfare. And this is Resourceful. And this is, when you play a cold block, nope, and Fire. Remove a card. Chant of Accuracy is at least a song that burns, is why I kind of like it. So I think it's these Poison Daggers. And then here, Foresight. Or Mind Visions. Ray of Hope. Can you save all damage plus one every round powerful? I honestly think I can take it.
heal at the end of combat? Yeah, I think we need heal at the end of combat. Don't we already heal at the end of combat, though? We heal when we go up the stairs. Alright, so expose armor. We're just focus back or focus second? Maybe focus second. Maybe focus second, I say, as I hit the back. Uh, it requires two full monsters, not bad. Requires one, yes. I do have a lot of random hits in my decks. A little bit of healing or a little bit of slashing in the front. Maybe just a little bit of... Sl oh, this is any monster. Yeah! He's got the good one. Andrin has the bad one. Alright, so what do we got? We got 8 energy, 9 energy, this is random, this is target, target, kind of pseudo target, target, random. So I think we keep the shatter, I think we're going to try to upgrade the shatter if we ever get the chance to upgrade, I don't know if we ever will. So it's, I have 8, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, eight, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I think it's this and then discard the shatter. Decisions, decisions. Let's vanish, let's vanish the shatter. I know I just added it. And let's discard the frozen one. I think I'd like the frozen one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's the elemental bolt that goes away. Even though it's the only targeted one, I think I'll have better luck doing it this way. So weaknesses is lightning. Lightning, lightning. So we're switching to lightning or we're switching to chill. Let's go to chill just because I think chills are... It's got fairly high chill, though. We're going lightning. So chant. Electric. 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 I was supposed to ice the barrage first. Oh, this is targeted. That's targeted. I was just trying to do random shots and I accidentally. So she's going slow enough that if he's got enough spark, he'll spark her. Oh, not enough. Easy. Okay, I need to slow down boss man and then we win. I need a slow from you. What do you got? What do you got? Do you have a slow in your deck still? No. So, what we're going to do... Dig for it. Close. So I have four. Here's a draw. As long as this draw. Excellent. So this plus this. All right, now we're all in front of them. And now I can... He's already at 10 stacks of vulnerable. So it's just hitting him as hard as I can or giving her some power. Oh, I have... I have fanfare. I have a lot more energy all of a sudden. This is good times. You know how much easier it is when it's not like a super difficult uh, elite or a super difficult um, corrupter? Easy. Not even a problem not sweating the least so this would be really great on gustav 
This one's actually not so bad on Andrin because I have a lot of captivating voices and I do have a setup. So I'm, I'm willing to pick this up. Maybe. I just... I have enough healing. I don't, I don't need more healing. I need more damage. Eternal Lullaby. I do have a setup. I can't play it on turn one though because my only ways to get it is Captivating Voice. But how many times am I looking for just a slow, right? It doesn't vanish though, and I don't always have... It's just a strong card. It's just a strong card. We'll pick it up. I think we can do Ballad of Conquest. It's kind of slow though, but we're having long fight issues. So conquest it up. All these are horrible. And does she have anything? Reveal four, draw plow, one into your hand, zero cost and discarded. So we've got the this can go find a winter's orb. So that's definitely worth it. Alright, remember you can corrupt things. I can corrupt things. Every turn four, that's beautiful. Um, Squire Staff, I can burn things. And what else we got here? Every Poison Apply Bleed. It's probably better than what he's got here. I don't know if I'm applying much poison, right? I've just got the one Blade Flurry. Excellent. Alright, now that we're through the rough part, that's the hardest it's going to be. Um, speed and damage. Alright, pathing. I want the most elites. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Ooh, so let's either go the Colosseum or go the top path. I think I'd rather go the Colosseum. And then I could go back up. I could go to the altar and the church. Yeah, that sounds really good. Yep, yep, yep. So I don't need to remove... I do need to remove cards here. Then I need to upgrade cards. Maybe I don't need to remove. Maybe I can upgrade. I got lots of shards. So when I go here, I need to either craft something if I'm missing it, which I don't know if I'm missing anything. I need more energy. What can give me more energy? I could change. I can't change this pandemonium. I can't change purples. Those cost too much. I need a fanaticism for Nesglect. So I think it's craft. So I think we're crafting a rare per hero. And I'm going energy. And I'm getting fanaticism. And the problem is you can only craft basics. I forget that. But uh, I need an energy there. Adrenalines for these two? Maybe. What about draw? Deflex. What about powerful? She's getting powerful every turn now, so that's not a problem. So she needs cold snap. Yeah. So I think because that's that's giving me a little bit of energy, right? And I can winter orb twice on a turn or frost nova twice on a turn, depending on what I want to do. Yeah, I think that's it. So let's go cold. Make sure I'm not missing any cold spells here. No, I think it's just I think it's just cold snap. So she needs a cold snap. He's already crafted something. Right? Remaining uses. Yeah, no more uses allowed. Uh, so this I need. Let's go songs. What's a really cool ballad that I could use? Eternal Lullaby. I wouldn't mind crafting an Eternal Lullaby for the frog. Because just starting out with that on turn one is really good. Or... I think it's Eternal Lullaby. Because we start with so much energy, right? And he's got the card. He's got the, the stupid... The, the super... So I wouldn't mind a trace 
before this eternal lullaby. Not a trace, a setup. Setup. Oh, except for it's a non-upgraded setup. Dang it. Um. So I've got plus evasion charges. So a ballad of evasion is really good. He's gonna really struggle to get it on the right turn, but I think we'll try it for it. Just because I want something a little a little beefy. Alright, so going down the middle. Whenever we play a spell. See all resistance resistance is 15, that's gonna be rough. Um do I want to go? I don't have much gold. You know, this game is more fun when you take corruptors. Battle of Evasion that I can't do anything with. Uh, so I think there's Captivating Voice and Blade Flurry. Since, oh, I did not play a skill. Is this a skill? Defense skill. I want to slow something down. I need to slow down Colin. I have to do that. And it's whether or not I want to proc evasion on myself or a lot of bleed on the spider. I think we just need to do the evasion on myself. Okay, and what do we get here? Five, six, seven. Yeah, that's fine. So, speed everyone up. Draw some cards. Draw some cards. Uh, who's going to be my kill target? I'm going before all of them. I think it's just kill Colin, right? So let's get some... Vulnerable. That's the word. I, I was struggling with the word. Not kill myself casting spells. And then the sharp. I don't know if... If anyone uses it, it's likely going to be Gustav. Next turn, Blade Flurry. It's really only like one sharp. I don't have any fanfare left, so I'm not going to do it. Pandemonium. Got a Shatter. Got enchant weapons. Are these how? Fire? It's always fire. It's always fire. She's going to blast herself pretty hard. So eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't want to cast too many spells, so maybe instead of the triple barrage, the barrage is really good, though. I'm just I'm going to trigger the uh, the backlash on myself. But I could just go elemental bolt. I think I'd rather go elemental bolt. So it's Nova, bolt, shatter. Not quite enough. So close. One hit point. Do we have thorns? We don't have thorns. Dang it. I, I thought the math was going to be right there. If I put it in the right order, maybe? Yeah, that's, that's super bad. Giving him a turn. No bueno. Uh, powerful. She's got lots of powerful. She's going to get four on her turn, so she's good on powerful. So we can start moving powerful elsewhere. Let's go here to Gustav. Uh, vulnerable next up is probably the Myrmidon needs to die. Or the Eyeball. No one likes the Eyeball. He's also got buffer stacks, so we got rid of that. And... Let's spread the vulnerable. Eternal Lullaby? Yes, please. What's it say? Damaged by others. Sure, sure, sure. We don't want that on our middle here. We want the back heroes to get the spark on themselves. Hmm. What's she drawing? She might vampiric into the something. She 
she's gonna pop dark on herself. Gotta be aware of that. Especially if I ask a barrage, which I'm about to do. Or cold snap. So cold snap a frost nova. And then icicle barrage. Here we go, a poppin'. This is target monster and a random monster. This is monster, but there's taunt. There's taunt. I was like, I'm so confused. Maybe I could put on the spider. So Nesglick does not have enough skills in his deck. I got too many healing spells. Alright, we got three things of melodic transfer here. Come on. Come on, let's not draw amnesia badly. Uh Andrewness, so I'm going before all of them, so let's just even out the healing. So let's get a little bit of love back here. And the Viper Strike. Andrin can't kill anything because Nez has got to do his thing. Nez, you need a powerful turn. No amnesia. No electric pulse. Foresight, yes. Fanaticism, maybe. Expected prophecy. That's a, not a skill that costs. So I needed to flip this expected prophecy to be a one cost now. I need one cost. I need one or two cost skills, and I don't have any of those going on for him right now. Alright, so... Skills, skills. I have no skills. No skills to play the bills. If I play this expected prophecy, odds are... Murphy's Law says I'm going to draw one of these. But if I draw Anthem of Hope or Banish, then I trigger more sight. Excellent. Never punished. Alright, so I got four energy. One, two, three, four. Or... Let's do a mental shake. Yeah. So mental shake. Anthem. I did this wrong. I could have played another two cost spell. When it is late, you don't play great. Could have fanaticismed and played the other mental ability. What's in here I can find? I could find a Ray of Frost. Two cost Ray of Frost. Or just play strong cards. I don't want to feed my decks because I'm really not... Uh... I might eventually hit a church. One cost, draw, skill. Perfect. Every two turns. So it doesn't happen the first turn. Everyone's got pretty good armor. Thanos Kiras on Andrin means he, he really slows down a bit, but he becomes super tanky. Because that's minus one speed for losing the Ranger Cloak, minus one speed for the Stainless. Uh, keeping till the end, probably keeping till the end. I could replace this here. This is just when you play a defense, which is really dumb card. So maybe this goes on Frog Boy. Who needs a Seashell Ring? Honestly, that could go to Andrin just for defenses, but I think... Greater Mana Potion goes to Evelyn. So that's Grass and Seashell. Yeah, because both these guys are keeping their speed. So Curass is an upgrade and Seashell or Viper. I've only got the one card that applies poison. It's a good card for the boss. But this is only saying plus like nine damage every time I cast it. This is just saying take less damage, so. Uh, challenge the arena. When you 
you block, apply, last four uses. Okay, cool. I've never actually played that card. At least, not recently. It's been a long time. So this copy a copy a song. This is one place spells do vulnerable. That's what we need. Faded future would have been nice, but uh, we have an arcade conduit. I mean, we have a spell echo already. Okay. As we've seen before, bosses without corruptors are super duper easy. All right, you're back of the line, dude. And I could put some stuff on you, or I could heal someone up. I don't really need to heal anyone up. Let's just see where we're at. And I do have momentum, so I need to make sure I do the melee attack first, because I'm forgetting these sorts of things. Fanfare, lots of songs. Sarcastic Sonnet, that's been our go-to. Now that everyone has their energy efficient things, our decks are humming a little better. In this case, probably not Pandemonium, probably Anthem. Let's find out. Do my card draws first. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Um, he's at three vulnerable, so maybe it is Pandemonium. So I want to put this back for next turn. This, this, pandemonium, and draw cards. His vulnerabilities is fire. Go figure. All right, we didn't draw it anyway, but we have eight. So I can vampiric tutor for a winter's orb. Nope, we got an icicle barrage. So six, four, five, six. So I set the barrage. Hold spark. I wasn't really paying attention to the order I did that in. Maybe I could have done it a little better. Do I need to slow him down for next turn? No. say that and he speeds the mess out of himself. Alright, what do we got here? She does need powerful. I need to slow him down. Slowing down works. I've got three energy. Can I draw any cards when you block? See, that's just such a weird card. So here, here, he's now slow. So who wants this? I want this guy to go find his good cards. I want those super songs. Let's get some healing in here. That's the song he's playing right now, in case you're wondering. Chink, chink, chink. Should have done banish. Should have done banish. Spell echo. Into frozen bolt. Or into Frozen Orb. But I have to discard it. Spell like one to Shatter. Spell like go into Icicle Barrage. Or Ray of Frost. Yep, it should have been Ice Crush. Now I can't shatter because I'm done. Because if I done frost weapons to myself. So. Here we 
And I just gotta do this one, right? There's no reason to not do it that way. So that cold snap was done with me. I need to ice up the brush. Tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Would you like some more vulnerable? I gotta get rid of the buffer first. There, I got some vulnerable on him. Hitting kind of hard. We're doing fine, doing fine. Cast a spell. Fly vulnerable. Fly vulnerable. Do 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 do. One cost skills. Yes, please. And it has energy attached to it. Last Requiem. Hmm. Mm-hmm. So. There's only turn three. I already talked about this one. There's just... There's very little going for it. Healing Serenade. Sure. Find weakness, one cost. Do I need more skills to pay the bills? Applying too many cards to my decks. Viper Ring. If I had gotten not gotten rid of it, I could have got the Corrupted one. I don't know what the Corrupted one does. When I heal a hero, apply Bless. You know, if you still had that plus one Bless Chalice, that would have been nice. Must go faster, must go faster. Problem is, I really like the harp. And I really like the ninja scroll. This is, I lose two energy for the sake of more bless. I think she just needs more energy. But she is peeled pretty often. I feel like I'd rather go. Let's try to let's try to go the blessed train. I don't like the minus speed to this. On hit burn speed scrolls. None of this I can do on these two. These these two already have good stuff. Unfortunate. Uh, what I say? I needed to go either to upgrade cards. Could upgrade. Can't really. It's hard to upgrade the expensive stuff. I guess they did change the pricing, is what it looked like on some of this. I could bring this down to a four, but it requires two. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Um, anything above a rare, I don't think I'm likely to be able to upgrade. Why would you want to randomly slow someone? I don't see any upgrades here that I want. I don't see any upgrades here that I want. I think I'd rather remove cards. I'm up in the 20s. Let's just go to the chapel again. Didn't I have an option for the chapel? What did I say? Go up. Oh, there's a chapel already. Okay, so there's. it's whether I go down for the, the yogurt or not. So let's go up top. Gustav does not need ambidextrous. Immune to insane, I mean Nesglik doesn't do as much. Tell me lies. Slow down, please. Thank you. Uh, who do I need to kill first? Siren chick, right? I should have done that first because I have momentum. I know how to play this game. I wouldn't mind the sonnet, but a ballad of conquest, I can't say no to. I think this will go long enough. I'm not sure that, though. Um, I don't need to do this right away, but I'm not going to be casting many other songs.
that I'm out of deck, basically. Uh, no one needs healing. I don't need to trigger this again. Shoo, 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 shoo. Magic mushroom. And just to trigger the pandemonium, or the chosen one, I mean. The plus one vulnerable charge on Nesglek makes a huge difference because of the chosen one, and I'm not allowed to pick it up. And that makes me sad. Uh, I can't cold snap the Icicle Barrage or the Shatter. This was a really crappy turn for her. Is the target monster version? That's a pretty weak shatter. She has to give herself a card next turn. That's basically all that was. So the problem with the whole when you're healed is you have to take damage. And I've been playing lots of evasion. So I feel like that was a poor choice on the part. Let's see if she can actually take enough damage to actually... Ooh, counterspell. This spells one, two. I need three dispels to get to that. You have lots of dispels. That's a dispel. That's another dispel, but it's not the right dispel. Uh, slow something down. I have a 50% chance. Well, poop. Um, so she is going to be silenced. Yeah, there's no way for me to work around that. And I needed the encore, and I needed the AOE one. So there wasn't, there wasn't, it wasn't like I did something wrong with that. It's just my decks are too big and went unwieldy. Okay, so she's silenced. Should have powerful myself before all that. Should have powerful myself again before all that. You got it, Nez. Insanes or cards. These cards are insanes. Should have done this first. Two cost skills, three cost skills. Dang it. There's no way for me to order this that that's going to work the way I want it to. Yeah, I'm not going to heal anyone if I Ballad of Evasion. Did that in way good order. Way good order. Do, 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 do. 
If I only had a brain. Draw the cards you want. Things happen the way you want. You gotta make sure your deck stays lean, lean, thin, and trim. Yeah, I'll take the corrupted sweet melody. I say keep it lean, keep it thin, and I keep adding to it. Danger. So, 400. See, changing these rares is super expensive. What's the blue ones do? Random. And, yeah, so the yellows. Yellows are the best. Blues are better than whites. So if I were to change one, I'd change this one. The shatter is always really what I want to change. So the non-vanishing shatter is what I need. Bam. There. Now my Archon fight is much more viable. Uh, let's see, what else do I need? Do, 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 do. Those don't upgrade the Bless at all. This Innervate just does more regen. I want the one cost one. I want this Expected Prophecy to go to one to trigger Nesglect. Uh, it's usually... You want to either upgrade the cards that you, you play anyway, or change the color of the ones that you're having issues with. What's Eternal All of I do? Yeah, I already looked at that. Nope, 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 can't do that. Tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Captain Moody Voice also looked at that. That doesn't do anything. Sweet Melody. I can make a Vanish. Maybe each of them could upgrade one of their Sweet Melodies to Vanish. Because they both have two. I like that. Yeah, that's, that's really good. Ballad Evasion costs a bajillion. Set up to get some Slice going. I mean, Slice, let's, let's change the Slice. Uh, change this to the better setup. These weaknesses. I think I'd rather have them be zero costs. 400 a piece. That's pretty expensive. And I'm still going to be cutting five cards a piece from each of these decks. So I want to find the cards that I'm definitely keeping and upgrade them that have high impact. Mainly this Pandemonium. Hmm. Mm hmm. Because it's six for four vulnerable. Or four for three vulnerable. Yeah. But that's that's all my shards to change that. I think I just need to upgrade some of my Evelyn stuff. No, no. no. Probably be keeping the Frost Nova. And two extra damage on it seems pretty good. Probably be keeping the Cold Snap. That looks good. That looks good. Saving out on energy is definitely a beneficial thing for one of my damage dealers. Gustav, do you have anything that you could... Uh... Targeting with the Annoying Whistle might be nice. Is Annoying Whistle going to make the final cut? Maybe not. Probably Annoying Whistle over Blade Flurry, although... I don't mind the fact that Blade Flurry is a triple hit. It's just it's not a song. So I think the Blade Flurry and the... Probably keep the shiv. The zero cost, I'll probably cut the shiv. At this point, I don't need it anymore. Like, I'm running out of monsters that have evasion. So, it's whether or not I want to increase 
any of these songs. I can't afford the expensive ones. Chant of Accuracy is going to go away. Captain voices and voices are going to stay, but they just their upgrade doesn't do anything. Sweet Melody, the non-yellow upgrade doesn't really do much. So I've already spent too much. I can't go back on the Nesglect one. Making this vanish is just going to stay in the deck. It is triple the sight, so it does become much stronger. How about we do that? Bam. We'll keep the mind vision because things will get sight and he'll just be able to explode things. I'll upgrade the fanaticism to the more energy version. And then I got 200 shards left. What do I want to spend it on? Clarities are fine. I'm looking for the, the, the commons now, or I can still, can I still do an uncommon? I can still do an uncommon. So the no, no color or the green flag. there whispering lies what does whispering lies do adds another debuff that's actually pretty legit to clear buffer so i think whispering lies is going to be the thing that gets it or one of these songs of quickness this spelling but it doesn't vanish i don't know if i don't like it not vanishing if i was to upgrade a song of quickness it would be in the andrin deck but andrin doesn't have um that going on maybe i do need something that doesn't vanish for it because if i get to round four yeah we did it song of quickness all right going up top nesglek baptism no thank you exotic equipment shop Ooh, probably uh, deals damage to me. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> okay, I can I can do ordering here. Wild hunt. Slice. The slice is free. I did not do ordering right. I was supposed to find weakness. Um, what am I killing here? This guy might taunt. She's going early, so let's slow her down. Okay, and then... This is the elite too. Yeah, let's just go focus on him. <laughs> so it's probably this, this, this. Hideous poem does look pretty good. Problem is I'm not gonna play it right away. It is weak. It is fifty for fifty damage for two. I don't need the sweet melody is the reason I'm looking at. So it's just one of the tedious poems. Let's get the corrupted one because reasons. And then speed up, slow down, buff up. Yeah, we're DPSing. And I'm really never going to play that card. Pandemonium? Yeah. <laughs> Rock cards. Someone that's not going to get die soon. So vampiric plus whatever winter orb. Vampiric for a shatter. Vampiric for a frost nova. Would I rather play an Icicle Barrage or a Frost Nova? Probably an Icicle Barrage because I have more chances to hit this front guy. The Shatter I like, but I don't want to do it on turn one. I could probably kill something with Shatter though. Let's go for the fun and random. Oops, what did I say? Um. Lightning, fire, 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 fire. We can do fire. Problem is, it's usually better to just go chill if you're going the chill route, but there is this, the back two that have pretty high chill resistances. We'll just go fire. Oh, this is any monster. Oh yeah, front guy's dead. Front guy's toast. 
I think that's toast. Front guy's not toast. Can I kill anything? Kill the back guy? Oh, I got 100 damage here. Some tanks really care about. Like this whole Heiner doesn't like the shield break. But Andrin don't care. How did that live? That's not nice. Alright, so draw cards. Speed ourselves up. Yeah, yeah. Dispels? Maybe not. Pop some evasion. Doing that because I have fanfare. And I think it's the dispels and heals. <laughs> One cost skills. Four energy. No amnesia. I can spell echo cold spark something back. So I don't want to draw my deck. So 12. And she's drawing five, so I can seven. Okay. I'm fine. Uno mas. Uh, cold snap. So, I think it's just cold snap the winter orb and spell echo that. That sounds great. Cold snap. Uh, One way to ensure that uh, people can heal you to trigger their golden bells and stuff is uh, to life tap. She's already got lots of powerful, so I could power for myself. And then. Oh, bye. nothing I can do about it. it it's it, they call it a bug I mean an ear what earworm they call it an earworm for me we're all super healthy they're all gonna die it is just what it is don't need to be adding cards to my deck Reminder to yourself. Samurai armor. Yeah. Too bad I don't have that viper ring anymore. Oh, it was poison causes bleed, not bleed causes poison. It's fine. Uh, no one's applying vitality. That's unfortunate. Uh, weapons. I have a weapon slot here. And nothing for those. Nothing for those. I'm there. Remember that weapon slot? Yeah, just found, finally found something to put in it. I can go Corrupted Lightning Spear. What's a Corrupted Lightning Spear do?
applies wet all damage that's a that's a plus damage was hit sparked and wet i am applying burn via nezglex scryer step so i don't think i can do that as much fun as that done what's a corrupted samurai armor do samurai plus evade charges interesting interesting i kind of want to do that just so i have a corrupted but i think it's frozen orb down here right down that one's with hit yeah it's frozen orb hit down here and then corrupted samurai i already have corrupted samurai armor i did not realize i already had corrupted samurai armor that's how much i was paying attention um Everyone will get the encyclopedia. No, thank you. Uh, immune to bleed when I play an attack. Okay, don't play attacks. I'd say Xandrin's going to play it on turn one. Draw a card. Slow something down. Give some power pull. And make something vulnerable? Probably make something vulnerable. Because, I mean, this repost doesn't really do much when I'm evasion tanking. Who do I want to kill? Uh, I'm not going for bug bite. I might be able to. I should be able to speed up with froggy dude. So, I think I want to kill either the harpy or the mugar. Let's just go for the elite. That was an attack, by the way. Just gave him all fury. Go me. Actually, do I have enough? So four. Five, six, seven. So. Sorry, five, six, seven, eight. So four, five, six. So I have two energy left. Yeah, I can sarcastic on it. I did that in a great order. Or I should have dwarfed myself and step her. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, sure, give her some cards. Banish some cards for her. I think we're going Frost Nova Shatter. Uh, let's get rid of a Icicle and a Transmission. Save that right there. Six. Did I say Frost Nova Shatter? Winter Orb? Frost Nova Winter Orb? What do they got here? We got fire. Did you notice that everyone has fire issues? It's also because I'm applying a little bit of burn. No, that's very little burn. That's There's no burn at all. Man, Nezglect, you're doing horrible. What, what weapon did I give you? Did I give you a bad weapon? I give you... I just I didn't give you enough skills to pay the bills, and you have no you have no sight charges. Mooger, Mooger, Mooger. Yeah, I wanted to do frozen ore, but it was better to do shadow. Can I say? Evasion tank, Andrin. Quick, someone hit him so we can repost. Is it when you fully block? It's lame. So I've got four. Can't do that. It's one, two, three, four. Do I need to dispel three? I think I dispel three is in order. Who's going next? Probably this guy right here. This guy does a lot of damage. She's chain lightning. Probably her. What can I say? They're all dangerous when they have fury and plus damage. What's who's got the highest fire resist? Rocky dude. Split it a little bit between those two. Give the cards to main man right here. 
Don't want that. And some dispels and heals. Doo -doo -doo. Do I want to give them 14 damage for them to give some fury? Probably not worth it. Them, so I don't need to dilute. I can save that for next turn. And don't. Do that 10 cards. Vampiric and the Ray of Frost. So there's nothing the vampiric Vampiric would hit the elemental bolt, so I don't need that vampiric. Don't need this. She's got five energy. I could just ray of frost something down, or I could icicle barrage some stuff. I'd rather icicle barrage some stuff. Whatever. Ray of frost. By Ray of Frost, we mean Ray of Fire. What are these guys doing? Lowest HP, self, fun, random. So she's got to die in the back. This already kills her, right? 109? Nope, doesn't kill her. 109 plus 15? 124? Not quite enough. Except for this should do some extra burn damage. Not quite enough. That's unfortunate. <laughs> How many times it's been by one? I could upgrade that life tap when I had the chance. I didn't think about that. I needed really to have uh, gone to the yellow life tap. Cause she has a lot of even cost cards and stuff. Turns out some cards are good. You get him. Four sharp, four bless. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Once I clear out some more trash from my decks, things will be nice. Mountain Ben, does anyone have a book? Inspire is not as good as energy in this version anyway, but it is plus two to all damage. Do you have a book? I think the only people with books are warriors and mages, right? I like the hunter's ring better than the seashell ring. Kind of like the steadfast more than this one, but this is fine. 
Avoidance collar. Every turn is pretty nice. But I would like him to stay going faster than Evelyn. We got 14. 13, yeah. That's doing piddly, but it's fun to play with. I want a corrupted one. Yeah, I don't see anything else I can pick up. Remove cards. So, one energy a turn, or fire and lightning. I do have elemental bolt. Which basically just turns elemental bolt into a, a zero cost card. So I think I'd rather just go, whoops, I'd rather just go glass game. Alright, Evelyn, what do you need to remove? You need to remove Icy Veins. Cool. Frostbolt, transmission. Oh, this this interface, it says 16, but it has a boon. Oh, fine. Transmission of these birds. Um... Clarities. The dilute's just a one cost skill. I think I need to keep that. Well, how did I get a third sweet melody? I don't remember picking one up. I got a corrupted one. That's what it was. I need to get rid of cards. Enjoying the captivating voice a lot. I don't think I need him to have a non-vanishing sweet melody. Because I think I want his final deck to be Blade Flurry, Slice, Find Weaknesses. So it means I get rid of a captivating voice and a Find Weakness. Or an ode to war. Do I really need the powerful anymore? She's got powerful giving it to herself every turn. Gustav also has ode to war. And Gustav has conquest. So I think we can get rid of this ode to war. It does say grant evasion, which I could do to myself, and I have lots of evasion charges. So that's pretty legit. But I think on turn one, usually what I'm doing is I'm playing a skill card. Oh, shoot. How many skills did I get rid of? I need to play skills, so I need to keep the skills. So it's the Ode to War goes away. And maybe the Sweet Melody. Yeah. And then Nez, what do you want to get rid of? Thinking of Clarity. Or this Mind Blast. So the clarities are giving two cards. I forgot about that. He he got his final he got his final out. 
talent. So also I need to remember to not pay for the last ones because I have three ones. Cool. You're fine, look for shards. Four lower. Frost resist 25%. When a player heralds a, plays a card, suffers. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I don't think it's going to make me lose the game, but it's going to be annoying. Draw before play cards. So I might get my eternal hunt. I did not find my hunt. Um. I need to slow down two of them, so I need the Eternal Lullaby. I have enough energy for it. I don't have enough stanza for it, so I can't do Eternal Lullaby. And that means we'll also put this back. So, slice, slow down the Colin. Not the Colin, but the Seahorse in general. Put some weakness on Boss Lady. Get some more post. Okay, so it didn't matter which one I did. Could have slowed her down instead of the sea horse. Yep. Sweet melody. One for to carry me home. Who needs to be unshackled? Doesn't one of us have an unshackling ability? I mean, other than just dispel. He'll unshackle himself. She dispelled herself. Did I misunderstand the way shackles are working these days? Did they sneak a change while I wasn't paying attention? Gustav's shackles should be gone. Is it the start of your turn? It's the start of your turn. I needed him to... But he got... I'm so confused. Okay. Why is Gustav still shackled? That is my question for the peanut gallery. Gustav is paralyzed. Icicle Barrage is what you get with Vampiric, not doing that. Eight, I have a Spell Echo going, so I want to play something big. Is it Shatter? Probably Shatter. So it's Shatter. Now I've got a free Shatter, and I can Cold Snap something back. So I could do a four cost, Cold Snap it back one cost, so I could Winter's Orb twice. So I need to Enchant Weapon before I do that. I should have done that before I did the Shatter. 
think... Oh, so I need to kill this guy. And then enchant to fire. Easy. Alright, let's see if you can dispel this right here. Right here. Dispel this. It's not dispelling the paralyze. Mmm. Ballot of evasion. Guy's already dead, so let's just back check. Of course, they're in the wrong order, but no one knows except for me and you. down a frozen orb not this guy that's right frostbolt got the kill Easy. <laughs> corrupted circle of healing I really wish this were the other version, but I think I do want it. Because this guy has lots of Inspire. Nezglect has tons of Inspire. When you play a spell, all monsters, yes please. Glandra, yes please. When you play a card... When you play a spell, I mean, I'm doing spells more than I'm doing skills, right? I'm really not with the evasion tanking. the The golden bell was 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 a little memey. Let's let's not lie about that. So I don't know if I need this. I think stimulant pills might be better. This is permanent. Reduction though. That's that's permanent. That's the problem. This he's been relying on the ninja scroll, so I can't replace his. Cost the songs in my spell. Like I just I can't replace that either. So the stimulant pills, as fantastic as it is, I'm gonna be skipping out. And then there's nothing else of value. Uh, speed, yep. Uh, damage, HP, resistance. Let's go damage. Two elites, we're going top path. And then the question is, do I remove cards? I can remove card from decks. Oh, no, this, we all have, uh, yeah. So we're not, uh, upgrade or craft. If I were to craft, what would I be crafting? A mana gem for Evelyn. A single cost skill, uh, an expected prophecy for Nesglect. Single crafting. Oh shoot, but these are not, they're not upgraded cards. Dang it. Hmm. 
Still a mana gem for Evelyn. Uh, a dilute for Nezglect. It'd have to be something that draws itself, basically, because I wouldn't have a chance to remove a card. So I don't think I want to crouch here. I think I want to upgrade, but I don't see what I would be upgrading. What would I be upgrading? It's basically the stuff I crafted last time. This transmission. I could just remove this transmission. Like, let's be fair. I could just go, say, remove cards and just go down one. I could upgrade the life cap. I think I upgrade. Upgrade to the life cap. Okay. So let's go upgrade two cards. And I upgrade this barrage. I think, what I say? The yellow? Yeah, the yellow one is the better one. But that, that vanishes, so it goes a little lower on the... I was just here. There's something I wanted to switch. Something I wanted to... I wouldn't mind a non-vanishing version of this. 1200? That means this needs to vanish. Can I get any of the rest of this to vanish? Oh, he's already done all his uses. Um, can't afford to upgrade a Ballad Evasion. Those don't do anything. Switching something. Find weaknesses to zeros. It was the mana gem. I didn't have a mana gem. It was, I, I did the thing. I did, we're good. Uh, Nezglek Sacred Ceremony. It is purple. It costs five. Front guy is immune to frost, so we're gonna have to go lightning. Or chill. He's immune to chill, but he still has a low frost resistance. Maybe not. Mm -hmm. I could have expected our expert tracker at first. That was probably a better call. Uh, Graham needs to die. All right, that's Graham. What? No, oh, he's he's just a dark monk, but his his elite version is Graham. Yes, please. That purple song sheet or whatever is really doing work. I forget, hers deck is actually looking pretty good that I don't need to start banishing stuff. Hmm. Okay, guys, I have the highest frost resistances. In order to enchanting weapon to chill. about that. Yeah, hurt herself. That way she can get healed up by the teammates. Um, what are they doing here? Heal on the team. When you apply regen, apply dark. That's not going to kill me. I'm not going to kill him. Mm. 
As long as I don't kill her by hurting her that much. He should be healed shortly. And she'll get lots of bless for having the, uh... Um, what's it called? You make her. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, with one rebate, two rebate. Would you like to draw some cards? <laughs> Mirror of Calandra and Spellico. Yeah, that's a thing. I don't really need the Inspire. I don't mind the Energize. It's a dead card for so many turns. It's a dead card for many a turn. I have to draw it on the right turn. That's just not going to happen. Does anyone have a deck that is cheap enough for mana? Nesglect might. No. Well, it's once cost skill rebates, right? So, one, two, three. Would I like to draw more cards and do more damage? I feel like I need to draw more cards. But damage with hit, sight, and... Um, he doesn't have the charges like this. Yeah. Corrupted. That's pretty slick. It's pretty slick. So I'm looking at their decks, and none of them, no, no one has a cheap enough deck for the metal. Andrin. Poison Catalyst, no. Exotic Shop, yes please. Immune to Poison, I'm okay with that. Haven't played against this guy or this guy yet. Shows how much I've played recently. Alright, slow down one of these two. Slow down all of these. Easy. These are all garbage. Do you know do you? So many energy at this point in the game. Because if, I don't know if you noticed, but as we're going along, we just get more and more energy. Um, what am I putting back? I'm putting back the nets. 
Who has the highest resistances? Well, if we switch, it's probably this mages. Okay. So, I could spell echo twice. I could winter orb, spell echo, winter orb. I don't know, like, does it does it really matter which way I do it? It's always the same, right? So, life taps and vampirics. Winter orbs, cold snaps, life taps, frost orbs, ray of frosts, frost novas. So what I can do here is I can vampiric for the shatter. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Dang it, it will copy the vampiric. I don't want to do that. So let's spell echo, vampiric, shatter, and now I can winter orb twice. Oh, I should enchant weapons. Where are we at on resistances? Yeah, I think we're just going with chill. Frost. Ah, I forgot. I forgot this was an AOE shatter. Spell echo. Shatter. We can shatter again. Let's do an icicle barrage first. Easy peasy. Whenever you play a card per energy to the highest HP hero. Yeah, okay, so I just hurt myself a little. She doesn't be that powerful because she's already got it. It just gets easier as it go. Still don't want you vitalizing, certainly. Oh, this is energizing. The other one was vitalized, right? No, they're both energizing. Um, do I want another Ballad Conquest? Do I, the other one I have doesn't vanish already, right? Okay, so I don't need a second one. Although, with the Super Harp, it's actually pretty funny because I can get them both down to zero costs. Sure, why not? Why not? Because it makes the rest of my deck worse? It's fine. Come on, something nice. Damage with hit. Apply vulnerable. Damage with hit, apply decay. Kind of helps. Um, I think it's just give more speed to that guy. And we're good. Golden Harp. Make sure it doesn't upgrade to something weird. By two. Hmm. Mm hmm. Uh. Do -do 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 -do. Yes. Excellent. Could have gotten a corrupted plate mill if I'd known that was here too. 
Um, I don't have another blade. Emulator speed. I feel like this is supposed to go to Gustav, but... I mean, I already have a corrupted one. What else do I got here? Glacial hammer. I feel like that's the right answer here. Frost damage up, charges down, but on hit, yeah. Okay, and then what do we got? Steadfast boots. These boots were made for steadfasting. Nope. Amulet of speed, last one. Evelyn, we're gonna still try the Kingmaker. It's hilariously dumb. Um, plus charges, I like. Although, plus four speed, so nice. I think it's one of the benedictions. Because I can never play three benedictions in a turn. Ta-da! We made it to the decks are mostly good. Immune to dark and decay, and he applies dark and decay. That is fine. Exotic shop for resources. Well, hello there, Rin. How are you today? Technically, I'm supposed to not screw up my turn order, I'm told. I'm not one to do that. My battle evasion for next turn, and what else? Um, who needs cards and filtering? So you can have enough energy for that. Four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. Six, seven, I could probably ditch this clarity and this fanaticism. Sheet music. Double Ballad of Conquest next turn, maybe? Oh, except for that's a level three. Dang it. The turn three one. Do -do 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 -do. Have mirror, have mirror, have mirror. We'll duplicate the first card. Vampiric, vampiric. Uh, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, not quite enough, but I think it's the icicles and the elemental bolt. And then the shatter at the end. Easy. All right, but I'm going to lose some energize and inspire from this uh, clone. No, I'm going faster than the clone. Look at that.
Tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. Hopefully you can see how all of my hard work has led to this moment. Oh shoot, I don't want her to draw too many cards. Eight? She's already gonna draw. Because Cold Snap, I'm having trouble casting Cold Snap, right? Draw too many cards, it's fine. Mirror, I have mirror. So I think it's Bell Echo Winter Orb. That cold snap spark's getting weaker because I'm not playing it. Spell Echo. Weapon. She's done that a little earlier, but you are kidding me, right? It's fine. Easy peasy. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is Madalus Ten Random. I struggled to keep the conversation up a little bit, but uh, two hero deaths. No! Times 4,000. So that's, you know what? But this times 4, 800, 4 to 2K if I didn't die. But uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed that. I uh, did get a little tired uh, near the end there, but uh, hopefully you saw the processes and you enjoyed. Let me know uh, any questions you have from that run. Uh, if there's any point in that gameplay, you know, give me a timestamp and like, hey, why'd you do that? And I'll be sure to answer it in the comments. Um, like, it'll be until I can get back around to, you know, checking out the timestamps and stuff. But I'm happy to I'm happy to answer questions, very specific questions like that. I, I do have time for uh, as long as they're quick ones to, to do that. And I will catch you later. Peace.